That was a great performance there from the Evil Floyds. Uh, before we start on, he said that he had a bit of a joke to tell us, so uh, do you just want to tell us that joke now? Go on, what was your <laughs> caterpillar joke? I don't mind going on for an hour. Wait, come on. We'll cut it out if it's not okay, good. Okay, well, there's a daddy caterpillar and a baby caterpillar. And <laughs> <laughs> the daddy caterpillar is like, come on, we're going to go shop and get the milk and the dinner and all for the mommy caterpillar. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> she's, she's laughing at the punchline. And um, he's like, come on, baby caterpillar, let's go. And then the baby caterpillar is like, okay, dad, I'm coming now. So then the dad's sitting in the car for an hour and it's like, beep, beep, come on, we're going, we're going. And the baby caterpillar's like, come, wait, wait for me, wait. And then the dad waits another hour. <laughs> and, <laughs> and the dad is like, right, come on, we're going now. And the dad's, the baby comes out and is like, I was putting on my shoes. <laughs> That's a good gag. That's a good gag. It's not really. Because it has lots of feet. Sorry. <laughs> right. I thought the caterpillar was going to turn into a butterfly because I was waiting so long. Would have been a better gag. Oh, yeah, like that could have made sense. Speaking of uh, butterflies and bad jokes, the name, Evil Flies. <laughs> I'm only messing. Uh, just... <laughs> <laughs> oh, I didn't even get that one. <laughs> Three seconds delay on the brain. What? Where did the name come from, the Evil Flies name? You can say that one. Um, we were all sitting in my house on the couch trying to think of names for a band and we came up with like some ridiculous ones like what names did you come Dill up with? Dill and Doe. Dill and Doe, you know, because when you say it fast, you know. Dill and Doe. Dill and Doe, Dill and Doe, Dill and Doe. <laughs> and then there was like other crazy ones as well. Oh, I can't remember them. But uh, a fly flew into the room and uh, me and the blonde Doug we were like, oh, we hate flies. They're like so annoying. And like, Doug was like, they're so evil. And I was like, yeah, they're just such evil flies. Like, so we were like, oh my God, we should call ourselves flies. evil flies. How did, how did the band come about? <laughs> like, when did you start? <laughs> uh, it, like, well, we used to be with each other, like, in a relationship, like, and then, okay. Like, for ages, like, we, like, I didn't even know, like, she played guitar or anything. Like, I knew, like, she just messed around with it, like, but yeah. she just told me then, like, that she wrote her own songs and then. She showed me them, like, and then I just put, like, a bit of a riff on, like, most of them, like. Mm. The first song was Down on the Way, like, that's the one. So, yeah. so it was just the two of you at the start? Yeah. yeah. Then when did the other two lads come into it? Just recently. Yeah, like, a month and a half ago, Doug yeah. came in, like. Yeah. And yeah. the drummer came in, like, two weeks ago. What, what, what made you, what, like, change? You could have been, like, a Glenn Hansard. Yeah, the team. It, it, we were <laughs> in, on there. We did a gig at the Academy. We are supporting uh, our mate Liam Geddes, like. Yeah. And, uh... It was like the sound, like it was just kind of dead. Like, yeah, so it was missing Yeah, yeah. we wanted more yeah. upbeat kind of yeah. music. Uh, and where would you say uh, rehearse is uh, is uh, stuff? Um, we rehearsed in my <laughs> house mainly, and then the Trabador, or the tr tr the Troubadour, the Troubadour, we just heard that Troubadour it's called. Um, but uh, we have no money, so we mainly do it in my house, wrecking the neighbors' heads. And you write the songs. Yeah. And does nobody else have any other influence in writing the songs? No, they did music. I'm terrible. Right He's on amazing at the end of like, Duh, like coming up with sound. So we saying it was very yeah. good, very impressive actually, very good. Yeah. As you saying, uh, so if you wrote if you wrote the songs, like where would you get your inspiration from? Just everyday life, like um, the song "Don't Run Away." That's actually about uh, people. Like Run I wrote about my friend. She got treated bad as a child. Like so, I was just inspired to write a song like dedicated to her, and um. Like, just everyday life, you know, like, if you're going out wrecking it in the clothes, and you know, all like, going out getting locked or whatnot, like, writing about that, or, like, fellas, the biggest inspiration, I have to say. <laughs> that's you, Jason. Yeah, it's No, it's not. Sorry. <laughs> uh, if you were to write any song that's already been written, what would it be? Write any song that's already been written? Yeah, it's a tough question, isn't it? I'm just going to throw that, that, that on you there. Hmm, what you know about Two Dark Cinema Club? What you know about Two Dark Cinema Club? Yeah. You into all that new skill kind of music? Yeah. Sorry, yeah. yeah, yeah. I actually love that band so much. <laughs> yeah, and MGMT and that. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. The stage is that kind of music, what kind of genres? No, I genres? love Coldplay as well. Yeah. Oh, I love yeah. Coldplay. Yeah. Everybody, yeah. everybody yeah. likes Coldplay though. Yeah. yeah. That's such a generic band to say. Yeah. yeah. Do you know anyone like Underground? That'd be more inspirational to you. Yeah. yeah. True yeah. on you as well there. Well, it's like someone that's like not really that famous or something. Huh? Not really, like, came to fame or anything. Yeah, kind of just up and coming that nobody would yeah. usually know. Key West. Yeah. Key West are very yeah, good, yeah. Yeah, they're really good. I like them. If you were to compare your band to any other band, what would it be? I don't even know what type of style we are. <laughs> that, that was going to be my next question. <laughs> yeah. yeah, what are we, like, kind of indie and kind of? It's like a mix. It's like a mix of between, like, not like, just acoustic and then 
kind of upbeat, yeah, upbeat kind as of well. punk rock or something. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Like I don't really know what we are. Do you, do you we just do it because we love it, like whatever style we are. Yeah, just hope people enjoy it, it, like, yeah. But it was very good. And that was Eva Flores playing here at Venue at Broadoak. Two.